The overall goal of this procedure is to quantify adhesion of bacteria onto cultured mammalian cells. This is accomplished by first incubating bacteria with cultured cells for a period of time. Next, the unbound bacteria are washed away. Then the cells are lysed to recover the adhered bacteria. Finally, the recovered bacteria are plated on petri dishes. Ultimately, results can be obtained that show the number of bacteria adhered to mammalian cells through counting of the number of colony-forming units on the petri dishes. This method can help answer key questions in the bacterial pathogenesis field, such as mechanism of adhesion and invasion of host cells, giving new insights on the virulence of bacterial pathogens. Generally, individuals new to this method will struggle because of lack of consistency in the washing and recovery step of the procedure. To prepare the bacteria used for this study, freshly plate bacteria from glycerol stocks, such as Escherichia coli pathogenic strains as shown here, on lysogeny broth agar plates and incubate at 37 degrees Celsius. Keep the plates sealed at 4 degrees Celsius for no longer than two weeks. The mammalian HEP2 cells used in the assay are manipulated under a laminar flow hood and maintained in high glucose DMEM with 10% heat inactivated bovine serum, 10 units per milliliter penicillin, and 10 micrograms per milliliter streptomycin at 37 degrees Celsius with 5% carbon dioxide. The cells are ready for an assay typically once they have almost reached confluence. Wash them once with warm Dolpeco's phosphate buffered saline. To detach the cells, incubate them with 0.05% trypsin EDTA for 5 minutes, then add fresh, warm, complete medium. Centrifuge the cell suspension at 2000 RPM for 5 minutes, then resuspend the cell pellets in deep.